So I've been, yeah, I've been wanting to watch, dude. Oh yeah, yeah, Sunny V two. Did you guys know Sunny? He's really good. I like his, I like his stuff a lot. We should watch, we should watch this uh, latest video. Oh yeah, dude. Oh my God. Remember? Okay, wait. Can you see that? Okay. Remember only Jayus. She just ruined her career, dude. <laughs> Do you guys know who Jayus is? She's like that TikToker that was really annoying. She literally still like as the thumbnail, thumbtail, bleh, thumbtail, thumbnail. Dude, I can't speak. She literally steals content. Yeah. Anyway, dude, let's check this out. Sunny V2, baby. I don't know who she is. Yeah, not many people know who she is. Here, I'll show you. Only Jayus TikTok. This is only Jayus. She has uh, 18.1 million followers and a crap ton of likes. She's massively popular, but she's very well known for stealing other people's content without crediting anybody. Yeah. And one thing that <laughs> one thing that you have to do when you react to stuff like I'm reacting to this video. But if you check my past reactions, I mean, obviously, if they have a problem with it, the original creator, they can contact me. I have no problem. But I always credit people. OK. You need to credit people like in my video description, I say original video by at at them so you can link directly to the channel the creator and then original video link here and then i say like again I, and then in the video like at the end of the last video i say uh go subscribe to this guy go like his video like you have to you have to it's it's all about a give and take you know i'm reacting to their content because i like watching them so when i'm done you know i i give them a shout out <laughs> i'm a small channel but still anything is like Good for them right who wouldn't want people to do that's free advertising react to my shit i don't care give me free advertising bros remembering only j remember only js she just ruined her career by sunny v2 all right guys let's check this out let me full screen this baby only js might officially be the world's worst content thief this is only js she's built a career stealing other people yeah there content. she is Here's her stealing from me last week she's being exposed in full compilations of her copying videos word for let me see that original if you're attracted to your friend's partners okay you got this original copy if you're attracted to your friend's partners she even has the same mouth she has the same mouth dude okay i don't even do that maybe Word i should do that and is now frantically creating fake reddit posts to explain where she supposedly got her ideas from the middle part with the script comes from a comment she made and then deleted the irony is that jayus had previously tweeted tiktok creators should be wait what did that say? hold on what did that say uh okay got her ideas from the middle part with the middle part where are we looking at when I when you start a new job, okay, I came across this strategy on 4chan a while ago. Obviously, I've never tried it myself, but it seems like it could work for the right person. Step one, when you start a new job, do just enough to keep it. Don't stand out or take extra tasks. Just avoid getting fired. True. Step two, <laughs> after three to six months of when a better paying position opens, make a sudden shift. Start uh start coming in early, work harder, and take a take uh, taking work home. Uh, make sure your effort is noticeable. Step three, when your boss asks about the change, say, if you're a man, if you're a woman, if you're a man, I found out the girl I'm seeing is pregnant and I need to, uh, to be more responsible and earn more money. If you're a woman, I realized I can't have children, so I'm dedicating myself fully to my career. Hmm. Step four, this will likely impress your blah, 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 offer you the promotion, uh, the promotion without you asking blah, 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 blah. Bonus step. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Interesting. Okay, but yeah, but real talk though, play, plagiarism at its finest, I see. <laughs> so real talk though, um, if you had a job that's like, okay, so you're getting, it's a bit, okay, a job is a business transaction. You're doing work for the company in order to get payment. So you should be doing the amount required of you for your salary, okay? You don't owe... You don't owe them any more than that. The script comes from a comment she made and then deleted. The irony what? is that Jayus had previously tweeted, TikTok creators should be called out when they copy other TikTok creators' videos word for word, which it comes... Dude, okay, that's so hypocritical. I mean, she's... 
<laughs> she's being called out. She's like a super copier, and she just says TikTok creators could should be called out when they copy others others TikTok creators videos word for word. Come on, man. I recognize the girl. I, I recognize that girl now when she has long hair. Uh, I saw a couple of her shorts uh, shorts videos years ago. Yeah, yeah. Most likely, the shorts that you saw were a copy copied of some other person that she didn't uh, credit. Come after another TikToker, the Jonathan Moss, had copied one of JS's videos back in 2020. Okay, let's see this. In March are way more likely to have asthma, and I can actually speak to this one because my little sister, the only one born in March, has asthma. The born in March are actually more likely to have asthma, and I can speak to that because my cousin, the only person born in March. <laughs> Dude, that's a copy. Yeah, yeah, maybe he's doing that just to be funny, uh, cause she copies people. But like, what is, what happened to TikTok? Is TikTok really that bad nowadays? I don't, um, I don't use TikTok at all. Well, I was about to lie there. I have a TikTok, but the only reason I have the TikTok is because the trend nowadays, or what you have to do now as a new streamer, is to get big on Twitch. You have to do TikTok, right? So bring people from TikTok onto Twitch and uh you know bring people from youtube shorts onto twitch so basically what i do is when i play dark souls or whatever and i have i have funny clips right so i, I clip them make funny youtube shorts uh, tiktoks i post them onto tiktok and then when people see that they'll come over to twitch right so that's the strat that's the strategy right <clears throat> uh so <laughs> um yeah tiktok uh, but i don't know what's going on. like is tiktok really that bad like is it is it super rot brain now i just don't know I, i'm a youtube guy youtube and twitch i don't watch tiktok i guess it's bad has asthma js therefore publicly called him out writing this dude has copied my content more than once and when i call him out on it he threatens me which accompanied the following video i just think it's really weird <clears throat> when other big creators think it's okay to copy my video word for word and act like you did jonathan replied by stating yeah so i just read it off google and it's really oh, just dude. reading right out the book essentially dude what accusing JS of copying and pasting articles she found on Google. JS uh, responded to this by stating, he said that he found it on Google. What? Wait, so she just... I mean, I do that. If you look at my videos, I have, like, the things that I... Uh, I have articles and stuff, but I don't, like, read the art. I'm like, like, just in today, blah, blah, blah. You know, I don't just read the article. I make it... I try to make it funny. Uh, I don't have a TikTok either. Yeah, and I try to make it funny and like, you know, go off that. But if she's just reading off the article, that's hilarious, if that's true. Which I mean he did, but only after watching my video. I'm now getting a huge amount of hate, people saying I'm lying, I copied Google too, I'm problematic, I should be cancelled, etc. I have a hard time dealing with the negativity before clarifying her position on stealing videos. I don't own facts, information is fair game, but blatantly copying content is not. Mm -hmm. However, Okay, so like, copy, copy stuff all right let me just point in fair game so youtube has i don't know about tiktok but youtube has a uh, fair use right so like what i'm doing now is okay i think <laughs> like reacting because i'm stopping the video a lot right i'm not just sitting here like letting the video play and watch it with and being silent trust me i've seen other streamers do this uh xqt <laughs> i've seen him do that um but yeah it's like i don't I, I don't just let the video play i stop it periodic uh, frequently and i talk about it um f so yeah so what was i saying oh yeah i was saying about the the fair use right so you could just react to stuff but if you don't like like i credit people as i said before but if she if she if you're like js and just literally copy people's content without crediting them at all that's a huge no-no on the internet but blatantly copying content is not however at this point in time only js was already blatantly copying others only js has been accused of copying content since vine this girl was called out for this years ago i only know her vine, because dude. she pops up every couple of years in copy drama she's Yes, you're commenting and reacting. Absolutely okay. Yeah, I mean, it's okay in my book. And if somebody has a problem with it, like if the original creator has a problem with it, they can contact me. I don't care. Uh, but I, I, cre I credit them, okay? 
trust me there's people that get way dude js 18 million followers she copies content without crediting thing me i credit people not even a thousand subscribers yet <laughs> people can get away with this shit Oh, wow. I only know her because she pops up every couple of years in copy drama. She's been doing this for years. Take for example her <coughs> first YouTube video. God isn't real but why he exists. Well, let's just play her audio while also- That's a really good thumbnail by the way. God isn't real but why he exists. That's a good thumbnail like that. I would click on that, right? She's a good- that's a good thumbnail real but why he exists well let's just play her audio while also showing a popular reddit post written by someone else on the atheism subreddit i have absolute proof that god does not exist this proof is absolute but immaterial okay you can't see it or measure it but it exists uh -huh. it's beyond comprehension and thus we should not even question it it's everywhere at all times you just need to have faith that it's there and that it's truth my proof is as real as any god. Jaius's script had been completely plagiarized. Strangely enough, she offered sources in the description, yet didn't include the post she'd copied, possibly to divert uh, attention from her blatant thievery. Let me see that. Sources. All right, it started. Why do people believe in God? Is there a source? Why do you believe in God? Yep, she didn't say that post she right. copied possibly to divert viewers attention from her blatant thievery in is time travel real js applied a similar strategy she made an interesting video using many mm. calculations and even love reacted a comment reading i can only imagine how much effort this took she'd supposedly gotten the information from these four sources okay yet she failed to reference this article here from which most of the video was plagiarized dude don't plagiarize stuff, please. Come on, man. That's a low blow. Be like the schools, right? The schools are like super crazy about plagiarism. They're like, do not plagiarize. We'll give you an F. We'll fail you or whatever. Yeah, don't plagiarize on YouTube. At least make it original. Original content, baby. Original content on the channel. You see it first. Like and subscribe, baby. <laughs> We can also control the rate at which we move through time. This is a consequence of relativity and that not all clocks are the same. Let's say somehow you were able to build oh my a God. to provide a constant acceleration of 9.8 meters per second, and you could somehow reach the center of the Milky Way galaxy, a healthy 20,000 light years away in just a couple of decades of your personal time. You could stop for a few hours there, have a picnic, take some pictures, and hop back on your rocket and come back to Earth. At least only... Dude, guys, that was literally word for word. What? That's hilarious. Wow. Only JS had changed a couple words. However, for another video, a look at Netflix, the same couldn't be said. Uh -oh. She began by plagiarizing Comparatech. As of 2020, Netflix users watched. Oh my god! Dude, I just love how it like is that. That's her real voice, right? It, she's literally just reading the article. Hours of video per day <clears throat> through service. That's six billion collective hours per month. Before moving on to Forbes. Netflix is facing some seriously steep competition with new powerhouses such as Disney Plus and the soon to be launched Apple TV. Concluding with a segment stolen word for word from LinkedIn post. In 2013, Netflix required massive amounts of fast storage and fast networking for streaming. At the time, it had 100 to 150 terabytes per server, which has grown massively since then. Netflix CEO Reese Hastings stated in 2015 that users have streamed oh my god dude it's word for word hours of video through the service oh my god it's literally word. like she okay so what I'm what I'm seeing here I've never seen one of her YouTube videos but what I'm getting at is what I'm getting here is like she'll um she'll source stuff but like she won't she won't like source the actual articles that that she took word for word like this right that's what I understand from the the other part of the video and uh, if she's just reading it and then like reading it from another article and then reading another thing word for word for another article without commentating on it, that's super plagiarism. That's crazy she gets away with this. Uh, I mean, it's you. I mean, the laws are different, right? YouTube, I'm not sure. Maybe it's okay on YouTube. I have no idea. But it, even if it's okay legally, 
it's pretty sh it's pretty sh kind of a shit thing to do right it's a low blow um <clears throat> yeah i don't i don't like that i don't like that style um if i i'm reading an article like i'll read the article and then i'll like talk about talk about that section that i read right you gotta break it up you gotta break that shit up bro very good editing and your script is also very good it's just a shame that jayas didn't write it some of her tiktoks were also pretty suspicious everybody's tired all the time right no matter how much sleep we get or caffeine we consume but also we have a lot of trouble even just falling asleep and we're constantly hungry but also kind of always nauseous we're spending every waking moment either working oh my God. or cleaning but feeling like nothing ever actually gets accomplished in a different video she simply took this me and change the character's name to match her own. Uh, who are you guys? I'm Productive Jays. And I'm Workout Jays. Yeah, uh, I was kind of just hoping to be relaxed Jays today. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that, that's fine. We'll just be here silently judging you. But you could still... That reminds this this kind of reminds me of like the other... I mean, there's so many other people that do this, like on YouTube short, the short form content creators. Dude, it pisses me off. Like, I forget that guy's name, but uh, he was under fire too. Wait, was it was it Sunny V2 that talked about him? Or who was that? Was it Internet Anarchist? Somebody talked about him. All right. Well, okay, I can't find it anyway. Let me X out of this crap. So, yeah, basically what I was trying to say <laughs> is that, yeah, there was another guy that does like, but he does, he like lip, he ad libs it or lip syncs it, right? And he lip syncs other people's audio from other like the audio of other people's content and he turns it into shorts of his stuff and he's like he's like a skinny guy with glasses i can't i can't remember his name but he's got millions of videos i mean i'm doing the wrong thing man i ain't gotta do that <laughs> i gotta copy people to get views <laughs> what the fuck all right argue there was some creativity. The sources were coming from other websites and Jace was converting them into video format. This was different to stealing from other TikTokers, which if we go back to her tweet, only Jace was strictly against. However, perhaps she hated other people doing it as this was secretly her strategy. If you're attracted yeah. to the golden retriever personality, if you like the golden retriever type of people, it could mean that you like being in control and making decisions. It could mean that you have some issues around giving up control. Okay, that's not, that's still like plagiar. All she's doing is changing the words around. Isn't that still like plagiarism in like school, right? When you're writing a paper. However, it could also mean that you simply like good company and that you're normal. Well, this could mean that you just like having good company around and you're normal. In examples such as that one, Jace had stolen just a couple sentences, but there were other examples where she'd copied entire videos. Oh my god, it's How worse. How to fake your own debt. How to fake your own debt. Immediately start paying off all your debt. You're also going to want to pay off all your debt. This ensures that no debt collectors will come looking after you. It's going to ensure that no debt collectors come looking for you. Next, start slowly auctioning off all your Belong. You're also going to want to start slowly selling off all of your stuff. The keyword is slowly because if you do this too quick, people will definitely be sus. And the keyword here is slowly because if you do it too quickly, people kind of get sus about that sort of thing. Randomly ghost all your family and friends for about three months. Completely ghosting all of your family and friends for about two to three months. And then regain connection before reaching back out again. Do this around three to five times and they'll think it's perfectly normal. You have to do this five, six, seven times. That way, by the time you actually do go and disappear, they're not immediately worried about it. Next, I suggest learning some outdoor skills. You're going to want to teach yourself some survival skills. Such as hunting, fishing, survival, etc. Hunting, camping, and farming. Because what you're going to do next is oh my God. far away from any people. Because you're going to have to go off the grid, somewhere remote. Stay there for the rest of your life. For the rest of your life. If you're over the age of 18, it's perfectly legal. If you're over 18, this is perfectly legal to do. Jace was also popular. I can't believe. Oh my God. That's insane. And you know what? This guy that made the original video probably got like 100,000 views, right? And she got like 1 million views. Which sucks, right? And she probably didn't even credit this guy at all. Basically, if they copy TikTok trends, I don't see any issue with that one. Yeah, that copying trend is fine. But doing this, taking a video word for word, you just saw it. Like taking a video word for word is actually insane. Like that's bonkers, dude. 
the age of 18 is perfectly legal. If you're over 18, this is perfectly legal to do. Jace was also popular for her endless stream of life hacks. And while they always felt intriguing and I original, it turns out these were also simply plagiarized. Did you know that- You know what the best life hacks video is? Filthy Frank. You guys know Filthy Frank? Are you guys old enough to know Filthy Frank? TV Filthy Frank, man. Peak YouTube. The quality of YouTube, YouTube, the peak YouTube content. His life hacks video is amazing. It changed YouTube forever. Anyway, if you replace let me back up a bit. Original, uh, it turns out these were also simply plagiarized. Did you know that if you replace this word en with simple, <laughs> just delete this en dot and type in simple, it'll simplify the entire article for you, and Wikipedia will dumb it down for you. But the name of your textbook, Dude. file type, two dots, PDF. Type in the name of the book your teacher's trying to get you to buy, followed by file type colon PDF. You might just be able to find your. You know what Sunny needs to do though? Sunny V2, the creator of the video, what he needs to do is like post like in this on the sides here he needs to like uh list the views and likes of each of both of the videos and i'm i swear to god if he did that you would see that the original did not get a, as many views as jadis js's video which is just is such a shame dude entire textbook and the whole textbook will just appear for free despite the mounting evidence no one called her out until jaya stole a video by a tiktoker named Young ah Mikes. boom the bomb exploded you have to act. okay wait so he's got what okay so she has 18 million followers and he until has Jaya 1 million he's video by he's basically he's basically nothing compared to her <laughs> tiktoker named yo mikes boom the bomb exploded <clears throat> you have to act immediately boom the bomb went off you have to act fast first of all don't look at the flash because it's going to blind you don't Look at the flash, it'll blind you. If you don't have a chance to get to a shelter, your safest bet is to lay down face down and cover your head. If you can't find shelter, your best bet is going to be to lay down on the ground, face down, covering your head. You have to understand there's still x-rays, gamma rays, beta rays. There's gonna be x-rays, but also gamma rays and thermal rays. They're gonna be actively burning you alive. They're going to be actively burning you. It's not gonna feel good, but you have to survive. Which are not going to feel good. Take the pain and run for shelter. You have to get up, fight through the pain, and just find fucking shelter. Mike therefore posted <laughs> proof only JS copies <laughs> Me, gaining 430,000 likes. Big, big mistake. You know what the mistake she made was? Is that he has a million followers. What she was probably doing is copying the people that didn't have a million followers and maybe had less than that. So they weren't like big shots. But as soon as she copied like a million follower channel, they are like, no, dude, I'm not taking that, bro. 430k likes. That's insane on TikTok. She stole your flow word for word, bar for bar. My whole shtick. Yeah, She's dude. She's trying to get any attention at this point. Word for word and pick for pick. Others defended JS writing. What? Or she Googled the same topics you searched and the same pictures popped up. Yet my clarity. That doesn't. Dude, people are. Oh my god, people are idiots. Like you just said, if they copy the trend, it's fine. She's like, Google the same topics. You searched up and the same pictures and popped up. There's a huge difference between Googling it and then making a video like in your own words versus Googling it and then just taking, maybe she didn't even Google, taking the same, she wrote the same script. She didn't even write the script. She read the same script of the guy. Like there was no originality. Yes, you can look up, you can Google the same topic, but make a different video. Sure, if, the, if you find a video that's like doing really well, by all means, take inspiration from it. But don't fucking copy it word for word. Dude, YouTube is all about though copying though. <laughs> In a good way though. What I'm saying, what I'm trying to say is like, yes, copy other people's content that did really well. But when you copy it, like change it up, like make it original, right? You got to make it your own thing. You can't just do it word for word. That's insane. That's insane. I said that twice. <laughs> Clarified all of what I said was written in a script by me. JS simply ignored the call out until it disappeared. However, over just the previous week, her content theft is again going viral after she copied a video by Everyday Alex. Remember when only JS got cancelled for saying the n-word? Apparently that didn't teach them to be a better person. Oh my god! I forgot about that. She actually said the n-word. What the- <laughs> Dude. She got super cancelled for that. That was a big mistake. Huge. 
when you get a new job, do just enough to not get fired. You're gonna put in the bare minimum. Just enough oh, here not we go. to get fired. Don't take on any extra work. Don't go above and beyond. And then after about six months or when a new position opens up. Like six months or whenever a new position opens up. Start coming in early, take work home. You're gonna come into work early. You're gonna ask to bring like work home late. Your boss will ask you why the big change. Your boss to come up and be like, what's up with this like sudden change? You'll tell him that you've discovered you can't have kids. You're gonna be like, oh, I just realized that I can't ever have children. So you're gonna try really hard from now on. So I really just wanna like throw myself into my work. They will promote you without you even asking. You guys are gonna get the job without even asking for it. After getting no response, God Alex damn. called her out again. Only JS is a notorious content thief. Her entire account has been built on stealing. And after pressure began to mount, JS offered her reply. She denied it and said this, that we What'd both she say? got the idea from the same Reddit post. The message read this guy is claiming I- Sorry about the raid today, guys. Sorry about the raid today, guys. Dude, can she not speak? Guys, not guy. Thanks mods for handling it and messaging me. This guy is claiming I stole his content, but we use the same reddit page and re and read off of it. I just I'm just gonna ignore it because I honestly it, Because honestly, it's kind of silly. Hope y'all are good uh, doing good. I'll be back Friday Stole his content, but we use the same reddit page and read off of it I'm just gonna ignore it because honestly, it's kind of silly yet Alex explained that his idea was never even from reddit I am offering ten thousand dollars to charity if she can send me the reddit post It's that one reddit post written by that one guy <laughs> with JS clearly lying Alex applied more pressure Yeah, well, what's that? <laughs> that was that reminds me of that uh, Metal Gear Rising game the quote <laughs> The source? I don't know if you guys seen that meme. My source is that I made it the fuck up. <laughs> Dude, wait. I gotta find that really quick. Hold on. Here it is. Dude, this is hilarious. This is what it reminds me of. Here, check this out. Nice argument, Senator. Why don't you back it up with a source? My source is that I made it the fuck up. <laughs> it's great. Ah, gets me every time. Post written by that one guy. With JS clearly lying, Alex applied more pressure. I was so confident I didn't get it off Reddit that I offered ten thousand dollars to anybody who could find it. Uploading a compilation of JS stealing TikToks, leading JS to start a live stream, excited to prove him wrong by showing this. Bro, I know that dude. She is this is her live stream thing. This thing is like a a thing from uh from Canva or Etsy or something. It's like a default thing. Did she is she doesn't even make her own starting stream soon screen start a live stream excited to prove him wrong by showing this long lost reddit post and this whole stream is gonna be getting this ten thousand dollars drop charity names that you would like to see this guy donate ten thousand fucking dollars to because that's what we're gonna do i got this video from reddit she claimed she screenshotted the post many years beforehand and would therefore have to find it i actually haven't even sat down and found the screenshot we yet. did There's see the screenshot well though over like thirty thousand screenshots in my phone right now i should have done this so what they're gonna say about this we did it seems she did find it before her stream, as embarrassingly, the screenshot was saved right there in her bookmarks. Ooh. Despite this, she eventually got it on her phone. I found the screenshot. It's this one right here. Uh -huh. I have a Reddit post of a Reddit comment. And yeah. I took the screenshot March 20th, 2020 at 7 24 p.m. This is the screenshot I took of reddit seemingly proving all the haters wrong i'm absolutely so fucking tired of people claiming that i'm stealing their content like from tiktok and I'm okay but even if you're saying that uh, you're so tired of people saying that you're stealing other people's content this is the only case that you might have an angle to because you have the reddit post or whatever and that guy probably the guy could have taken it from that as well but if you look we looked at the other videos and the examples in the video and she, you obviously she obviously copied word for word from other people even if those people that she copied from, the, if he, even if they also copied from other people, she's still copying though, word for word. You shouldn't do that. I'm just not. Until every day Alex proved that the Reddit post and screenshot was made by JS herself. We did some digging <clears throat> and we found she uh, doctored wait, a screenshot. I didn't catch that. First I didn't catch that, what? Wait, what? Hi, DinoFish102. Welcome to the YouTube chat. Thanks for joining. We're also streaming on Twitch. The Reddit post and screenshot was made by JS herself. 
No way. No way. Did she make it her? No way. Oh, we did some digging and we found she doctored a screenshot. <laughs> it firstly showed that Jayus had modified the screenshot's date. And I took the screenshot March 20th, 2020. The date thing is meaningless. Here's a fake post we made and this is how easy it was. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. You can, dude, you can easily fake that. And by showing that the screenshot could have only been taken on the most recent iPhone. JS claims her screenshot was taken in 2020, but the screenshot she showed had a display of 1290 by 2796. The only iPhone mm -hmm. that has that display is the iPhone 15 Pro Max, which was released cool. late 2023. True. If I look on my 13, it shows uh, the resolution. That's true, man. Oh, she got she got good or she got getted. As shown here, she had an iPhone 12 in 2020. But in nah, case this ooh. didn't already prove it, Alex then showed Big exactly mistake. how the post was faked. We used software that searches Reddit for recent deleted posts and found that someone named JSYT posted the full script on a subreddit called r slash bad fake texts. Obviously she did this so she would have a real looking chunk of text she could use in her main doctored screenshot. After Alex aired his video, JS conveniently deleted her live stream. However, her behavior hasn't changed mm. as she just posted the following ripoff. If you're attracted to your friends, partners, if you're attracted to your friends, partners, dude, and when stop copying people. Like you said earlier, Augie G, uh, the least she could do is credit the original. Yeah. The least you could do is put the freaking link. All, dude, it's so easy. Just copy and paste the link to the original creator and the video. It's not hard. Asked where did you find this out, she once again lied. This series is from some conversations my psych professor liked to have with us about attraction. Uh, I highly doubt it. Nice. Wow, okay, that was a shorter video. Wow. She got outsmarted. Yeah, she got outplayed. Uh, all right, guys. Thank you uh, for watching that. That was uh, remembering only remember only JS. She just ruined her career by Sunny V2. Um, that was a great uh, Sonny always banger videos. Uh, make sure to go subscribe to Sonny. He's awesome and like the video. I just liked it myself. I'm subscribed. Um, and when I make it the video for YouTube, I'll put a link in the description and stuff. But dude, <laughs> I'm really tired of people like just copying content. Like TikTok, I guess TikTok is just rot. It's just the rot brain. They got the rot brain over there. Yeah, so... <laughs> Dude, crazy, crazy stuff, man. Don't don't copy stuff. If you're gonna do like a reaction like like this, what I'm doing now, make sure you like comment on it, right? Comment, make a commentary, and uh, credit the original creator and put a link to the video. You gotta do that. Do it, bro. Yeah.